Hi, this is Charles Henson with Nashville Computer. In this video, I'm going to show you how to edit the Mac filter list on a D-Link router. The purpose for doing this would be to simply allow access to only specific devices on your, on your network or to disallow certain PCs from accessing the network. So the first thing we'll want to do is click on the Apple and then click on System Preferences. Once we're in System Preferences, you'll choose Network. Here we're going to find the IP address of the router. Once we find the IP, we're going to open up uh, either Chrome or Safari, and then we're going to type in the, the IP address of that router. Once we're here, we're going to log into the router. Some routers have a password on the bottom side. Some of them you should just know the password to. Whomever set it up would have access to that. Then you click on Manual Setup. Once inside the setup, we're going to click on Advanced, Mac Filtering, and here you'll see the option to turn off Mac Filtering or to turn it on. And we can either allow computers access to the network or we can deny computers access to the network. So we'll choose here that we're going to turn Mac Filtering on and allow computers access. Once we do this, we need the Mac address of the machine that we're going to allow internet access. So to do that, we'll go back to the Network Preferences, click on Advanced, click on your Hardware tab, and here you'll see the MAC address of this workstation. We're going to go ahead and highlight that, and we're going to right-click and choose Copy, and then we're going to go back to our web browser where we have our router settings, and we're going to right-click and paste that into the MAC address settings here. Now we can choose uh, give it a computer name if we want to. We can set up a schedule. Um, we can also say here's the name of the PC that we're going to use. That way we'll know whose PC it is. Now we're going to click Add and then here you can set a time and date schedule. So if you want to block people access during lunch or uh, maybe you want to give them access only during lunch to internet then that's where you would come in and set that. The reason you might want to do this is so that you could block internet access from particular workstations on your network. 